Hello everybody, Kite562 here, and I have another Tentacle Tales of Terror episode for you. So, as always, these episodes premiere every Tuesday at 4pm of every month on a weekly basis, so sit back and relax and listen to what I have to say for episode 14, and that's the statement of Randolph Carter. Carter by H.P. Lovecraft. Now, these reviews are of my own opinion, so sit back and relax and listen to what I have to say about my first time diving into this story. So, the plot from my understanding is Randolph Carter is being questioned by what I presume is to be the police or the FBI of the time of Carter's colleague, Harley Warren. Now, Harley Warren and him have been experimenting with strange occult objects or books if you want to be more specific. So I thought this was a really atmospheric type of horror story, so sit back and relax and listen to what I have to say about it. So Randolph and Harley were great friends for five years, but it seems that Harley had acquired a book with strange writings and characters that Randolph never seen before. The book was acquired from India, according to Harley Warren's account, and this is just from according to the story. And I have to say my favorite quote from this story is, it is true that I have for five years have been his closest friend, a partial sharer of his terrible researches into the unknown, the statement of Randolph Carter, page 81, and this is Randolph saying it to the police about Harley Warren's practices with the occult in this strange book that he acquired from India, which I thought was really interesting and intriguing for the most part. So as the story goes on, Har Randolph reminisces about the time that they went to this old ancient cemetery. So, as I wrote down here for point number four, Harley wondered why some corpses remained firm and flat for thousands of years. Well, fat for thousands of years. As he and Randolph explore an ancient cemetery near the Gainesville Pike within the Big Cypress Swamp. And I'm assuming this place... Of the story also takes place in England, so if I'm wrong down in the comments, please let me know. But yeah, uh, Harley was interested at how, for thousands of years, the human body can stay youthful or, you know, immortal in some way. I don't know if vampirism has anything to do with this story. Couldn't really find any details on that, so hey. <laughs> yeah, all in all, this was a really solid story in my eyes. So, again, for my final thoughts, overall, enjoyable, eerie story about how people should not disturb one's final resting place. You may not know what you might unleash upon yourself or your loved ones. And that's what I have to say about the statement of Randolph Carter, that it's a cautionary tale about messing with someone's final resting place. I mean, how would you like it if somebody were to steal the flowers off of your grave? Let me know down in the comments. And as always, what's your favorite HP Lovecraft story? Let me know down in the comments below. This is Kite562 signing out. Leave a like, comment, subscribe if you want to see more content or hear some content from this channel. This is Kite562 signing out. And as always, I hope you have a wonderful day, everybody. Later.